Okay, hello again. This is me again. Uh, today we're going to uh, <coughs> make a video about uh, how to uh, automatically lock and unlock, protect and unprotect worksheet a worksheet uh, with VBA codes. Normally, you can you can do that by uh, uh, using protective features under the review tab right here you can find it in under review tabs review ribbon protective then you have to uh, enter your password and to <coughs> make sure to untick unmark here select all lock cell unmark it and, and okay you can also put the password right here like ABC you repeat it and then boom you can select you can select the all cell because all uh, default by default Excel is uh, make this <coughs> range is locked for editing you can unprotect it just by clicking it and put and enter your password now it's normal now be sure to check this before you protect your ship under protection tab look here by default it's locked so if you want to make a certain range or certain cells to to be unprotected while the others the other cell is protected you must go to format cells and be sure to unmark it so these cells will not be protected even you <coughs> uh, activate protect it right here okay that's it for 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 an introduction of protect sheet features now <coughs> we're going to do what we are going to do is to bypass this these procedures with uh, VBA codes you know just like that uh, uh, <coughs> for this example we're going to use a uh, uh, shapes shapes like a rectangle or a circle or whatever as a button now okay so the idea is when i click this sorry lock sheet the idea is when i click this button this rectangle uh, act like button uh, the sheet right here sheet one will be locked with a certain password which we're going to put it in VBA codes so without entering password in this box right here we have a cell that uh, protect by password <coughs> after this going to we going to developer tab and activate visual basic windows just like is visual here we have now a visual basic window click insert module now we're going to make a sub of lock sheet put this now this code is to protect or lock the seats active seat which means this seat one right here okay because we have 
we want to be we want this to be password protected we must add password let's say yes okay and don't forget This and this code is for unmark uh, this. We add one more sub for unlock ship. Active ship and protect password. Sorry, should be lower cap. Okay, now back to the Excel sheet. We're going to make another one. One lock. Okay. All you have to do is right click right here and assign macro. Choose lock seat. Uh, by the way, you you can uh, name name the sub or the macro with whatever you want, whatever you want. For this, we uh, I name it lock seat and unlock seat. You can change it with change some whatever you want. So back to sign macro, lock seed, and this is should be unlock. Okay, let's try. Remember this area is unlock. Will not be protected later. Okay. Sorry, uh, we're going to uh, this cell. Okay, so the yellow area will not be protected. Okay, click it. Boom. This area is not protected. You can select it, but outside this. You can click or make other. Okay. Then you can even protect the ref. Okay. But to unlock it, boom. No. Oh. Just like that. It's easy. Okay, you should try it yourself. Uh, if you have more questions about this or any uh, requests Excel about Excel tutorial, uh, make sure to drop your thought or request or questions in comment section below. Thank you. Cheers.